Hi, I'm Matt Belez, and I'm a product manager at Google. I'd like to tell you about the new Layers feature of Google Maps for mobile. To help explain, let me show you how I use Layers. When I go somewhere new, it's always fun to turn on the Wikipedia layer to learn about what's nearby, which is easily done by finding Layers in the menu or pressing 2 as a shortcut. I work in our London office, but I'm visiting the Googleplex in Mountain View, California this week. And so here I am, and here's the Wikipedia entry about Google. Neat, the Computer History Museum is just down the road. Trusty clear map in the menu helps me keep the map clean when I'm done with a particular layer. Now, let's turn on the latitude layer. That's my picture. And there's my friend Ryan, who appears to be working from the San Francisco office today. We talked about meeting up after work, but where should we grab a bite to eat? What's cool is that in this version of Google Maps, we've added the ability to view My Maps on your phone. So let me bring up a My Map that Ryan shared with me, which shows his favorite places in the city. Interesting. It looks like Ryan's actually very close to one of his favorite places, Gordon Biersch. Best garlic fries and burgers in SF, he writes. All right, the garlic fries settle it. Let's get driving directions. 36 miles in about 37 minutes, over 40 in traffic. I always like to check the traffic layer before hitting the road. Looks like the road is mostly green, so traffic should be pretty light. I guess it's time to head out, but I just remembered I'm low on gas, so I'm gonna need to fill up along the way. Let me do a quick search. Notice how all the results come up as a layer of all the gas stations in the area. Looks like there's a bunch of gas stations at the 101-92 junction. Great, I'll plan to stop there. But before I go, I just thought I'd let you know where to get these new Maps features. To download the latest version of Google Maps for mobile with layers, just visit m.google.com maps from your phone's browser.